Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to another exciting episode of This Is Our Life. This is a bottle of Pepsi that I am drinking. Um, I want to provide you a link to the article. Uh, it's titled, Why is the Federal Government Disarming Veterans? Um, and it gives you information, including information about Brandon Robb. Um, you know, and another thing I, I want to point out is, if for those who remember the or know about the uh, little saying, first they came for the communists, then they came for you know this or that. Well, first they came for the people who grew gardens in their yards, then they came for people who for the people that were drinking raw milk, then they came for the people that were raising hogs. And I didn't stand up and say anything because I didn't do any of those things but you're next. I'm next. This is some scary time. These are scary times we live in, people. Very scary times. Uh, Bob Woodward, uh, I haven't read the article yet, but Bob Woodward is saying he was threatened, which doesn't surprise me. For those of you who support Obama, I don't understand how you could oppose the same policies under Bush now, I never supported George Bush. I never supported Bush. I never supported Obama. Um, they're both uh, clowns, and they're they're both um, serving the bankers, and that seems to be what it's all about: power and money. And Obama has done nothing more than continue and expand on Bush's policies. You claim to hate these policies under Bush, but now you like these policies? That makes absolutely no sense. None whatsoever. But I'm going to provide you with uh, one article, and look, if you really care, you'll go and look up the other articles. You may or may not know about some of the things I, I mentioned, like the hogs, the pigs. You know, I don't remember where it was in the Midwest, I think, where the government went in there and killed uh, farmers' hogs. And um, there's scary and sad times we live in, people, and not enough people are standing up to say, stop it.